Royal fashion fans get excited. Princess Diana's 1981 wedding gown is set to go on display at Kensington Palace in London this summer. The new exhibit, titled Royal Style in the Making, was announced by the historic royal palaces via Twitter and is set to examine the relationship between fashion designer and royal client. The gown, which was designed by Elizabeth and David Emmanuel, was worn by Diana during her 1981 wedding to Prince Charles. With Diana, she, she chose us because she was used to the designs that we did. She liked them, felt comfortable. E.T. spoke with Elizabeth Emmanuel back in 2018 ahead of the royal wedding of Meghan Markle and Prince Harry. And she reflected on designing Diana's iconic gown and how not all things went according to plan that day. Well, we'd done a practice run of putting Diana into the coach uh, wearing a calico toile but we didn't really take into account the train because that was 25 foot of it. So when she actually did get into the coach and her father, who's quite a large man, was sitting next to her and there was 25 foot of train, you can imagine it was a bit of a crush. So when she came out the coach, it was, you know, a bit of a shock for us to see the creases, although we had anticipated a bit. The dress is now owned by Diana's sons, Prince William and Prince Harry, who have loaned it to the HRP for the exhibit. The brothers are also planning to unveil a statue of their mother at Kensington Palace this summer in honor of what would have been her 60th birthday on July 1st. Prince Harry publicly reunited with Prince William to attend their grandfather Prince Philip's funeral earlier this month, a sign that the recently icy relationship between the brothers was thawing. This was just an icebreaker. Anyone thinking that everything has been resolved at a wake I think is sadly, you know, misguided. Royal expert Katie Nichols spoke to ET about the possibility of Prince William and Prince Harry putting their royal rift aside for their mother's statue unveiling later this year. Things were not going to be resolved in, in one or two family meetings. So while this has been an important step, I think there's still quite a way to go. The idea that Harry's suddenly going to come round to William's way of thinking and vice versa, I think is, is a way off. I think there do need to be more conversations. There's clearly still a lot of hurt, a lot of resentment and a degree of mistrust, I think, on both parts. So it's early days, but I think the hope is that come July, when we are hoping to see the brothers stand once again, shoulder by shoulder to unveil the statue in memory of their mother, that the relationship will be stronger and in a better place.